Welcome back. Adam Hampton, the man who saved us from our own decorative errors, has joined us in the Lifestyle Live studios because you're looking out for us last minute dudes, right? Last minute shoppers. We've got five days left to shop, mm -hmm. and we've got lots of unique, fun gifts for everybody in the family. We've got great gifts for kids, adults, um, everyone. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. So uh, Christmas is coming. Is it this weekend? I wasn't sure. So. Is it? I think it's Saturday. So if you need anything, come shopping. 5515 East Washington Street, Historic Irvington. We've got lots of fun stuff. Now, in, in your story, is there any particular theme or um, angle that we should be looking for and have in mind? If you want something unique off the wall, something that you're not going to find in the big box stores, uh -huh. that's where we're at. We've got local artists, local creatives. We have really fun stuff, um, stuff that's going to take you off the phone and back to nature. We've got these really fun dig kits and um, crystal kits that I love for kids. These are great for um, teenage boys, teenage girls. Young kids as well, so Ed lots educational, of fun. right? Yeah, educational items as well. You know, I'm trying to find a gift for George, but he has everything. Everything. George so has what do I everything. Do if somebody has everything, I can't get him something. Or you know, I love if somebody has everything. Crystals are so fun to me. They're um, beautiful. They're easy to buy for, and it's just fun and beautiful. So selenite, amethyst items like that. Um, also, pop culture items I think are really fun for people who have everything. So a favorite movie, a favorite song, um, a memory that's going to take you back, something like that's going to be a great gift. You mentioned uh, having artists selling their wares in your shop. And this is, you have, you have original pieces as well? We do. We have over 50 local creatives inside Hampton Design Studio and Shop, which we love and uh, we appreciate all of our local artists. Um, Amber wants yeah. to know about this. Yes, yeah. Amber loves this phone. <laughs> yeah. um, this is one of our most popular items this holiday season. It's an actual phone that you can plug your phone into and talk out of. And then it's a purse as well. So we've got lots of fun bags like this, um, quirky items like the takeout bag. And they're just really fun and unique, you know, for kids, for adults as well. That, that's full on funny. I mean, the bag phone. You know, absolutely. With the, yeah, 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 absolutely. So. so people come in for last minute guests. I, I think I know the answer, but is it mainly guys are coming in or is it the gals too? Or? You know, it seems to be a lot of gentlemen that yeah. um, oh, seem to shop last minute, which is great for us. We've yeah. got lots of, you know, stock and lots of really fun items. So feel free to come in and shop last minute. We've only got five days left, so you got to do it now. Um, most places aren't shipping, so shop local, shop your favorite local shops and restaurants and, and this week. Adam, I know you agree with me on this. It is fun to do last minute shopping. You're in the spirit. Everybody around you is in the spirit. Yes. It's, it's good karma, right? It's the best. It's my favorite day is the 24th to shop. You'll see me out bright and early shopping and then at the store 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. on uh, Christmas Eve. All He's right. going to be out shopping in a blizzard. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, there's a blizzard coming. So get out here now and shop. Yeah, shop go. now. Yeah. Yeah. Amber? Well, the scarf that I've been wearing this morning is also courtesy of Adam Hampton. I told him, oh. I said, that matches me. I should wear that today. So we've been sporting it for a little bit, but now I'm too hot from the baby segment, so we're going to have to, you know, wait on that. But switching gears now, it is a fun place for early childhood, pre-K, kindergarten, and first grade teachers and students. We are talking Crawford the Cat, and here to tell us more is one of the founders behind it all, producer and writer Russ Harris. Russ, man, it's so good to see well, you. Thanks so nice, much for being here. Nice for here. having us, yes. Okay, let's dive right into it. Let's talk Crawford the cat because it's really it's cute and adorable for kids but there's also some um, meaning behind it some nice messages too right when we uh, created Crawford my partner and I uh, Brian Reynolds yeah and, um, we wanted something that would kind of appeal to children that maybe uh, moms and dads might enjoy too and it started out with five minute segments on video and we had uh, things that mom would tell you a lot to do. <laughs> and we thought yes. they'd watch it a lot. Like, yeah. You know, washing your hands, brushing your teeth, sharing with your siblings. Yeah, but yeah. that's how it all got started. And then we made uh, five-minute shorts. Yeah. Oh, and, how cool. Yeah. And then we finally ventured into a half hour. I think yeah. we got a clip of that somewhere. Yeah, I think so, too. And uh, then we said, let's try books. So let's that's what we're doing books. now. Yeah. And that's what you have in your this hand right, right now. Right. This one is about going to bed. Uh, bedtime routines, which they yeah. say are very good for kids. And, Super important. And uh, it's written in rhythm and rhyme. Yeah. And, and it's written all K1, K3. Can but don't you think when kids can attach that to a character, it can make all the difference? Right, right, because they'll look at the material over and over again. When uh, when the videos were first out, teachers were 
the ones that really discovered us and were running the yeah. videos in their classrooms because they were short. Right. And the kids would ask for them. Okay, we'll give you five yeah. minutes. You know. So that's how it all got going. It's so sweet. I was looking on your guys' website this morning. I believe we have a clip. There's a Crawford the Cat Christmas, but there's so many other things as well that really helps teach kids. And I say, if a kid's going to be on an iPad, I have a four-year-old son. I said, yeah. let's try something that helps him learn. Right, it does right, something right. for him. Right. And this is what Crawford the Cat could do. Right, right, right. Absolutely. Yeah. What kind of responses do you get from parents? Oh, the ones that are familiar with it really enjoy it. Yeah. And, uh, they request stuff, and they were requesting uh, a bully video that we did oh. make. Um, how to little kids how to handle being bullied and stuff. Yeah. Like so we didn't give specific information. Just go tell a parent, tell a grown up, tell someone you trust. If something like that's happening right. to you. And I wonder why, for someone like you, having to be you know a founder, a creator, that it is important to you to have that that message, you know, that right, there's right. something that they can, it's a big takeaway. Right, right. Well, our whole philosophy about when we made animation was, yeah. um, you know, always have some sort of message. Don't make it just pablum. Something yeah. they can take away, and if they like it, they'll watch it again, and it's right. just reinforcement. Now, I want to make sure I'm correct, but this started here yeah, in yeah. Indy. Yeah, yeah. How cool is that? <laughs> Absolutely, yeah. And that's amazing. Yeah, we, we've been doing it for quite a while now. Yeah. And uh, so it's been fun. And yeah, we made I a lot of films, right. and, uh, but Crawford was the one we decided that well, he's really the one, so yeah. let's push him a little bit. Okay, so goals from here on out? Uh, more Crawford books. Okay. Maybe more video. We don't there know. You go. And uh, to see where it goes. Well, I love the idea behind it. It's exactly what I'm going to introduce my son, <laughs> my kiddos, to when I get home from work today. QR code right there on the bottom of your screen. Russ, such a pleasure. Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank we you very much. Appreciate it. All right, George, on over to you. <laughs>